Here's how to install TikTok Pixel manually to your Shopify store. Hey everyone and welcome. I hope you're doing great, everyone. And let's actually get started. But before we do that, let me just explain who would want this kind of tutorial. Because there's uh, an easier way, if you didn't know, to install this TikTok Pixel on your Shopify store. It's only a few clicks. But this is going to be for those people who um, want to basically have more options to set up manually so this is going to be for them but if you stick with me to the end uh i will show you both methods both manually and also uh the easy way so whether you want this one or that one i will show you both so just stick with me so now let's actually get started on how to go ahead and set things up for your tiktok pixel on shopify so the first thing that you will need is going to be outside of your Shopify store. You will need to go ahead and open up a new browser tab. And if I didn't mention first one, I will show how to actually install it manually. And then I will show the easy way. So this is for the manual part. So you go ahead and go to your TikTok business. So just type in TikTok business. And here you will need to obviously uh, just um, log in for your TikTok business account. If you don't have one, you can just sign up through this same link and you'll be able to do it easy from here. So after you sign up and you have your account ready, you should find yourself in a dashboard that looks uh, like this. So basically what you will need to do is just go hover over tools here uh, and very simply go ahead and click on events. So we want events, so you click on events. From here, you will be given these uh, options. The one that we want to, to work on is going to be the web events. So you will need to go ahead and click on web events. Uh, also, for this manual part of things, I will not actually go through the settings that you have because obviously everyone wants their own different settings and stuff. So this is going to be like pretty much based off of what you want. And you can also like change things uh, afterwards. But I will show you pretty much the method and then you can set things up the way you like basically. So here you will need to click on create pixel under here to get conversions. You need to install a pixel first. So create pixel. And then from here, we will start our uh, manual setup. Now you can do the partner setup, but we want the manual setup. So we just click on uh, this one right here. And then we click on next. In here, you will need to simply just have the pixel name. So just name it whatever you want. So I'll just go ahead and name it uh, tutorial list pixel for the sake of the tutorial, obviously. So we just click on next after we type in the name. We just give it a sec and we uh, pretty much have the pixel created. And now is going to be the setup part of things where you will need to just, you know, um, do all of these uh, tasks here. If you want, you can just, instead of dragging, dropping everyone to awareness, uh, consideration, or conversion, we can use a template that we like, and I, depending on what which uh, one you want. So we can just do commerce, and uh, you can check out uh, certain templates. If you like this one, you can just apply it, and I believe this one is best for um like your store so i will just use this one for now but obviously it's going to be completely up to you to change it you can just hold drag and drop to uh the way you like uh and then we can just click on next and you can always skip the step by the way so in here we will need to uh, just keep these two and if you want to have an event builder you can also check this one but let's just keep it unchecked and click on next uh, and here is going to be where most of the things are going to be different for you so here you can set up a, a lot of the settings for your pixel uh, you've got the general event uh, api only general stuff here and for each um, page kind of so you can go uh, add to wish list and you can choose the settings for it so here is going to be uh, the main part of actually installing it uh, manually where you will need to set things up the way you like. I think this is why most people do it uh, manually because they don't get as many options as you would get doing it this way. 
So uh, I will just skip this, but after you're done, and uh, but by the way, I believe that you can also change it later on. If you do, if you like made a mistake or something, you can always change it later on. And I also oh, I will also show you how to do so. But after you're done setting up each one of those to your liking, you just go ahead and click on next. Uh, and this is basically how you finish things up. If you want to see instructions and stuff, uh, you can allow all of these things depending on you know uh, your whole your whole idea of how you want to install the pixel. Again, I'm not going to go th through the preferences because this is not the point of the video. I'll just show you how to install it, and whatever you want to turn on, you can do it yourself. So after you're done setting things up, you just click on finish. And you should be pretty much uh, ready to go. The pixel is created. The only thing left is going to be obviously uh, using it on your Shopify. Uh, and to do so, you just go ahead and go to um, settings, I believe. And then you just scroll down until you see the uh, code. So you just go to, um, hold on, let me find it. So it is under here, TikTok pixel. And you can see view base code. It's under settings, like I said. Uh, TikTok pixel view base code. So basically what you will need to do is just simply copy pixel code and just go back to your uh, actual Shopify store. From here, you will need to paste it uh, in two different areas. So the first one is actually just click on your online store uh, and then go ahead and go to your code here. So we just click ne next to customize three dots and then edit code. You click on that. And then from here, you will need to go to theme.liquid. Uh, from here, you will need to paste it underneath a uh, head here. So if you just uh, create some space for it, excuse me, my cat is annoying. Hold on. Okay, so you will need to have it um, uh, and under head and slash head. So if we just create a space for it, uh, paste it here. And if I, if I forgot to say, you will need to actually, you know, make sure you back up your code first before you actually do this, just so, you know, ensure you don't mess things up. Uh, and then you just create a space for it. So under head, you just paste it over here and just click on save. So this is step one. And then you will need to also paste the code somewhere else. You will need to go ahead and go to your settings. From settings, you will need to go to checkout. And then from checkout, you'll need to scroll down until you see uh, additional scripts where you can just paste it over here and click on save. So this is pretty much it for installing it manually. So this is how you do it. And I will also, like I said, include how to um, install it the other way. Okay, so uh, it's going to be the easier way. So if you don't want to go through all of that, you don't want specific settings to set up, you can just do it the other way, which is just go into your uh, Shopify dashboard to your apps. And then you just go to your Shopify app store. And then from here, you will need to uh, look up an app that is called TikTok. So this is this is the one right here. But if you don't find it, you can just simply, you know, uh, search it in here and you should find it. So TikTok, make sure you don't select an another one because there's plenty of TikToks. Uh, make sure this is the exact one by, you know, TikTok Inc. So you will just need to install. And then um, from here, you will basically will need uh, to enter your uh, login information for your TikTok business account. And then you will be able to simply create your pixel with one click. So it's very, very easy. It's just, you know, if people want to install it uh, manually, it's going to be a different method. But this is the uh, easier way. So you can just click, you know, click on uh, set up now and just follow the instructions and you should be good to go. I'm not going to actually go through it exactly because it's very simple. I'm not going to need to show you. You just click on connect here. It's going to ask you for, for your uh, login information. And then you just follow the steps on the screen and it's going to be uh, pretty much done for you that, that way. So it is very simple. So this is basically how to install your TikTok pixel to your Shopify store. Uh, I hope it was uh, easy for you to uh, follow. And uh, yeah, this is it. Thanks for watching, guys.